What is up, guys? Welcome back to some Battlefield 4. I'm actually playing Rush on Dragon Pass. I know. I know. Uh, if you saw that chat message I, I first sent, I was like, we were just playing defense, and I was like, I've literally never seen past the first base on this map. And that was true until after this game. So this is my first ever winning round of Rush on this map. I honestly had never seen past this base. Uh, so this is partially for educational purposes in case you guys, you know, ever get past this first base of tanks and anti-air BS that they chock full. But uh, anyway, uh, it was kind of funny that I was like, I've never seen past it. And then here we go winning this round. But anyway, I just wanted to talk about uh, this map and a few rush tips, you know, if you guys don't play much. I know it's really not the best game mode for Battlefield 4, but you know, I got my Keurig machine working again. I went like four days without coffee man it has been rough so I'm finally I'm finally back in the game if you guys drink coffee out there and if you've ever just like had like a, a spree where you couldn't drink coffee or something oh my god Ugh, I, I'm back in it I'm back in the game look at me pistol this dude how did I hit him I think I might have a hack on I'm not sure maybe, maybe I do maybe I don't anyway um yeah like you're gonna see us pretty much steamroll into these other bases I mean obviously uh, to win this map you have to be playing against a team that's not the best in the world, but still, it was actually a pretty entertaining game the whole time. So, I pick up this uh, Dao 12, which should be called the, uh, the AO. Just, just take the D off and just call it the AO because this thing is monstrous. And every time I shot somebody, I was just like, AO! Uh, anyway, it's pretty sweet. Uh, I actually don't even have it unlocked yet. I just realized it after I went back and I was like, oh, I should set up a class with that shotgun. Yeah, I'm so bad at doing challenges. I never. I just, I can't make myself like sit and play one map for like hours or grind out challenges. I'm the worst when it comes to that. So anyway, I go on a little nice tear with this thing. It's it's so powerful, man. It, it's so good. I, where has it been all my life? I, I've been behind on the, the, the AO train. But anyway, uh, another rush tip is to make sure like whenever you're waiting to move forward, go back and clear out the spawn behind you because you never know what might be lurking. And if that sniper would have gotten a spawn beacon down, that could have put a hurting on us. Uh, another thing is, make sure you stay alive. You notice I'm not running Assault here, so um, I'm pretty much our team's only spawn point. So just stay alive. If you're the last man in your squad, make sure you don't die or, you know, get those paddles out if you are Assault. So, uh, just a couple quick tips there, you know, make sure you know what you're doing uh, as far as... Or be, be heads up whenever it says last man in squad and you're pushed up, you know, like this far. Look at this Ace-21, you know, punching his time card, going to work. Look at that. Triple, no big deal. This thing is so good. Uh, whatever. Oh my God! Look at that dude's body. What is up with the ragdolls lately in Battlefield? They've just gotten cray cray. Anyway, yeah, the Ace uh, 21 is a solid choice. I usually put it on when I'm going try hard. You know, put my small on my repair torch, and go to town with my engineer class. I just I love engineer too much not to play it. As you saw in that first clip, that ridiculous small shot. Like how bad it would have sucked if I jumped out of that airplane and like went to small the helicopter, but instead I was running assault and just like threw a med kit at it. Uh, check this out, by the way. Speaking of running assault, look at this rifle, man. The SAR-21 is way better than most people make it out to be. You can't really rush around with it because it does have a pretty slow rate of fire, but from range, holy crap, this thing is powerful. Uh, and the hip fire isn't bad, you know, if you get too close to him, but the thing is powerful and you just kind of burst fire it, tap the mouse, oh, it, it is money in the bank. Anyways, guys, uh, this is what the last base looks like. I did cut out the second one because I literally did nothing. I had that shotgun the whole time. I was just running around throwing ammo to my teammates. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for checking out this Rush video. Um, let me know if you guys have actually made it to the end of this base or if you play Rush. Have you seen this base before? Because this was literally the first time I was like, huh, so this is where this map goes. I was always kind of curious. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for checking out this video. Make sure to follow the links down below for my computer and Twitter and this music that we used. And I will talk to you later.